Hey everyone, we're back with our second box break of 2020. This is Topps Heritage Baseball. Uh, this is bringing back the 1971 Topps design. Major League Baseball, look for limited and exclusive 1971 Topps baseball tattoos. Uh, I apologize for my hands. I've been doing some housework and painting and such, but uh, I rubbed it, cleaned it with alcohol and everything, and I'm having a pain in the butt getting it all out. But I assure you, it is dry as the day is long, so the cards will not get any blue on it. Of course, by now, you've all uh, dealing with the effects of the coronavirus. Yeah. Uh, Lucas uh, school will not be going to school next week. Uh, they, have take, they have canceled our rescheduled April vacation. Yeah. Uh, and then they'll probably be teleworking, teleworking, uh, teleschooling. Uh, just like uh, online learning. Online learning uh, for a week or two uh, until hopefully this gets under control. Uh, yeah. Baseball, uh, they canceled spring training. They pushed back opening day at least two weeks. Uh, NBA has suspended operation. XFL has ended their season. Major League Rugby has suspended uh, play for 30 days. Uh, Everything's happening. It is. It's dire times for television land and uh, in everyone's life. But I'm hoping everyone's staying safe. Yeah. Uh, you know, that's the number one thing. Uh, you know, so uh, I just wanted to put that out there to begin with. Uh, I also want to announce that uh, Lucas uh, is now an official bona fide podcaster. Yeah. Uh, him and his friend Seamus yeah. uh, have created a podcast named Nerd Stop Discussions Without Repercussions. Uh, and it's everything nerd related, geek related, uh, comics, movies, uh, goosebump plot twists, uh, times that he did a fire alarm but almost by accident. Yeah. Uh, so there's a lot of cool stuff on there. Uh, it's available on every major platform. It just went live on iTunes. Uh, if you go to firstcomicsnews.com, you'll see. Uh, the podcast is available there as well. Uh, Spotify has it. Uh, yeah. Anchor has it. Everyone has it. Google. What's Google's Google thing? Google Podcast. Google Podcast uh, has it. So please give it a listen. I'll leave this young man some voice feedback uh, so they can play it during the show. Uh, but until then, let's uh, open up this and show it off. Hopefully we get some good cards. I do have some live box breaks coming up. Uh, the distributor has been pretty spotty this year, unfortunately. Uh, but I will be sending out an email. We do have a few more box breaks to do, but I mean, with the coronavirus uh, hitting, uh, who knows, who knows uh, what's going to happen with that. So, how many packs? Who knows? Uh, who knows? I should be able to tell. Seven oh, packs? Uh, yeah, eight. Well, eight packs. Eight. Uh, one bonus pack. Nine cards per pack, so eight packs. Look for exclusive 1971 bazooka numbered test cards. So that'll be uh, pretty cool. I want a bazooka. Heritage has uh, alternate photos and everything else as well. Uh, so look for those. And uh, this is always kind of a fun set uh, with the pose. Pick your four packs, my friend. I'll take this one. Ooh. This one. Ooh. This one. Ah, damn, I wanted that one. All right. So here we go. All right, so this infamous uh, 1971 set, I, I don't know if I should say infamous or not, but uh, it, it's renowned for having uh, not hard to find in near mint condition because of the black borders and the way they cut. It oftentimes was dinged or chipped, uh, but these look pretty good. Uh, and then on the back, you have a uh, black and white headshot along with some information. No cartoon, unfortunately. You know I, I do love the cartoons. Uh, and it looks like, let me see if the photos, yeah, so the photos are different. I thought maybe they were just the headshots of the front, but you can see that there is different. Yes. Uh, so it says a little biography here. There's a headshot. Andrew Heaney gives you the stats. In 2017, he started the, the Pup Cup 5K9, a run for humans and their doggy pals mm. that features on-site ad adap adoptions. Run proceeds benefit the Children's Hospital of Orange County. Okay. Very cool. Yeah, 18 games, four wins, six losses. Uh, like that. Yeah. Uh, like that. Of course, my card is an Indians card. Of course. Woo! Right off the bat, Indians take a 1-0 I lead. I have no idea. I've never seen this person in my life. Nick Whitgren, uh, Heritage. I don't know. Uh, he had his best season in 2019, trimmed his walks. Uh, I don't know. It doesn't sound familiar at all to me either. I mean, it's it's tough being a, a baseball fan sometimes. The Indians, obviously, uh, probably not going to sign Francisco Lindor again. Uh, Red Sox uh, firing their new man their manager. Oh, good. Yeah, because uh, he was associated with the Astros cheating scandal, uh -huh. uh, which uh, is, is still is still killing the game. Uh, it, it's amazing. Uh, 
Big Poppy Dave Ortiz says the guy who, who ratted out the cheating shouldn't have did that, uh, which is bizarre. But baseball has some weird rules. Uh, you can't enjoy a home run that you hit. But if you, if you know a team's cheating, you're not supposed to do anything about it. Well, you have to, you're supposed to run the bases and show no expression. If you flip the bat or you celebrate too much, the pitcher uh, will often hit you with the ball the next time you have the bat. I don't know why either, because it's, it's the most bizarre thing. It's like they're trying to kill the game itself. Yeah. Uh, the old school, every time you go on MLB Network, uh, you'll hear the old players from the 70s and 80s saying, you don't show boat, you don't enjoy, you just round the yeah. bases. It is stupid. Absolutely stupid. Anyways, uh, here we got game, uh, 2019 Game 4 American League Championship Series. Uh, we got uh, oh, the wrong way. Yep, the Astros, uh, who of course cheated their way to the championship. Uh, Carrera, one of the you know renowned cheaters of the team. Uh, how did they cheat? They uh, <laughs> how did they cheat? So for the younger kids in the audience here, yeah, they they have a, a monitor in the, the dugout where if you wanted to challenge a play, you'd look at the video and see if you wanted to challenge it or not. Mm -hmm. uh, it, it gave you a live feed. So when the camera was showing the signs the pitchers were given, oh. they're not supposed to have access to it. So what they did is they stationed someone, uh, they set up cameras in the center field at the home, and they broadcast the center field camera into the dugout, oh. where when someone saw the sign and they knew it was coming, they'd bang a trash can. So if the batter would heard of the trash can, he knew it was a slider. They'd, yeah. they'd work out whatever it was based on the pitcher. And that allows you to anticipate yeah. the pitch if you know it's coming. And uh, I mean, they ruined people's careers. Yeah. Uh, there was a pitcher, uh, I believe it was with the Blue Jays, who went into Houston. Uh, and he just got hammered. And he got sent down to the minor leagues the, uh, the next day, and he never came back to the majors. Oh. Uh, so, yeah, it's pretty horrible. Uh, and then uh, Carrera, they think he was wired with a microphone or, yeah. of some sort. Uh, and he he hit a home run and he was running and they were gonna tear his jersey off and celebrate. And he was like he was telling the people, "Don't do it, don't do it." And then they came up with some stupid. He had a tattoo. He didn't want anyone to see. It was, it was bizarre. Uh, but their but their record uh, will be forever tainted. Uh, the poor Dodgers, who twice should have won, uh, really had a good shot at a World Series, were definitely robbed uh, yeah. by that. Uh, again, no, no action shots, but they did have these multiple rookie cards, which is pretty cool. Uh, I mean, oh, it's just good to see the players, you know, smiling, having a, you know, it's a, it's a relaxing Why time for Why does this form. not look like a real person? Yeah. This feels like a fake card. Fake this card. does not look like an actual baseball catcher, player. Uh, catcher wearing the uh, the mask and helmet. It just doesn't pushed up. look real. I don't know. He doesn't look right. No, nice mustache, though. Yeah. Tony Waters. Rockies catcher, huh? Like the stash. First, get, first year in pro ball, 2010, huh? Oh, he didn't look that old. Ooh. And I uh, got uh, another, another one. 2019 Game One National League Championship Series. For who? Who was? Uh... Uh, Annabelle uh, flirts with no hitter and win. Oh, for the Nationals, nice, nice. Nationals uh, won last year, and as far as anyone could tell, they uh, they did not cheat, so that's good. Oh, here we go. Speaking of the Nationals, we got the World Series Champions hey. card. That's awesome. Uh, this is card number one in the set. So if you have it in a clear box, this is what will be sticking out at you. Great team. It was great to see, uh, you know, their, their star player, Bryce Harper, left uh, for nothing but money, really. Uh, and uh, they went on to win the World Series. I mean, just an amazing story. Um, they're just fantastic. Just a solid set. If you do through the male autographs, which again, much like uh, the anthrax scare back in, during the Gulf War, uh, with this uh, coronavirus, uh, people have, a lot of them have stopped uh, doing autographs in person. Hopefully they'll do it through the mail because the, the virus can't live that long. I got flashbacks. Uh, Ooh, these are good. Card. Yep. Intel chart. Uh, Intel changes the future of computing. Oh, they built the this microprocessor. Is the first microprocessor release. Awesome. 1971. Two years before I was born, and uh, God knows how many years before you were born. A lot. That's cool. I like the flashbacks. I wish they had like one in every pack and really made this like a heritage set and had like a, you know a substantial number of that year. Of different events and stuff because you know oh well, i think that'd be cool we have got no big red Sox or uh i mean we may even get the last mookie Betts red Sox card uh before he was given away to the dodgers all right uh we got uh two, 2020 rookie stars dodgers dustin may and gavin lux okay okay 
Is that his hair or is that a tree in the background? That's his hair. That's right? his hair. Couldn't really tell. Cool. And uh, we got uh, my first Red Sox card. Nice. And it's a pitcher that I've never heard of. Nathan Eovaldi. Eovaldi? You never heard of him? No. Hmm. He's battled back from two uh, elbow surgeries, huh? Nice. Doesn't look like a pitcher. Looks like a catcher. Yeah. All right. Let's see if we get some action here. All right. Lucas, you done goofed. Oh, I did? See that thickness? Yeah, I do. That, my friend, is something a little different than the normal. All right, well, I'll show off my cards. You do. I'll show off mine as well, but not that one. Keep that for last. Joe Jimenez. Look at these guys. They look so happy. Yeah. Although I sincerely doubt they're actually that happy. <laughs> well, folks, <laughs> they're making killer money. They play the game of baseball. So what else do you want? All right, uh, I got uh, Candlestick Park, uh, 20 Giant Seasons, or 20 Giants Seasons. Oh, that's a great card, yeah. Uh, two, 1965, San Francisco, California, Willie Mays. Willie Mays, awesome. Great player, great card. I got a Game 3 World Series with the Nationals uh, at the Astros. I got a Very mini cool. card of Vladimir Guerrero Jr. for the Toronto. Oh, Bay. a mini card? Awesome. Can I see? Oh, Guerrero's a great player. Look at that mini card. Awesome. Very cool. I got a home run leader for the uh, National League. Of course, Pete Alonzo, Rookie of the Year. One of, the, one of the more desirable cards. Some of these photos look like it's like... Uh, like the backgrounds like... may not be real. I think, they, 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 yeah. they, I think they're in the studio. <laughs> I couldn't tell. Uh, <laughs> uh, some of these just look like uh, just like kids' baseball cards that they made. Like they're like they're like got these big smiles on their face. Like, eh. Hey. Yeah. The yeah, photo day is a uh, is a great day where they take pictures for both all the sets. You know, they take all the pictures for the year. At <laughs> once. So obviously fake too. And then my card is a, a Joey Gallo Clubhouse Collection. Game used memorabilia, hand numbered. That's a lot of titles. Hand numbered. Hand numbered. 99 out of 99. We got the last one. That is pretty cool. Hand numbered. I'm going to check that. Hand numbered. Hand numbered. Hand numbered. I've never seen tops do like hand numbered. Usually they're those stamps. Yeah. Uh, let me see. But here. this one's hand numbered. Hand numbered. There's high number sh uh, short prints, one in three packs. Pablo Chrome. He was on the Red Sox for a year. Yeah, where is he these days? He's on the Giants. Oh, he went back to the Giants? Apparently. Ooh, there's French text, one to 242 packs. Errors, text. missing signatures, throwback uniforms, nicknames. My God, there's a ton of variations. Um, gigantic seasons, bazooka cards, baseball tattoos, one in two, 729 packs. My God. Uh, Senator's final season autograph, man, that sounds cool. Clubhouse collection autograph relic, no, no, relic gold, no. Relic is one in 71 packs. Oh, maybe they're all numbered. Yeah, that's interesting. I, I'm, usually their, usually their relics cards are not numbered like that. That's very cool. Ooh. Oh, you still got another pack? Yeah. All right, all right, all right, oh, what'd you get? What's that? Uh, this is a New Age Performers, Lucas Giolito. Ooh. This looks like a new card, and uh, that is all for me. All right, uh, Carson Kelly, I'm going to be willing to bet, didn't show up to get his picture taken because <laughs> uh, he has a big headshot there. Uh, Clint Frazier used to be an uh, Indian's highly touted prospect. I thought they may have gotten him back. Uh, that's the look of an to... outfielder uh, when the when you can obviously tell it's a home run. He's yeah. kind of like <laughs> he he's not happy. No, he's not. Man, that's it. One Red Sox, one Indians, huh? Yeah. Man. All They're right. Both uh, pretty unknown. Yeah, no superstars in this. Jesus, for ours, for us anyway. And then uh, Ozzy Abiz for the Braves is our last card. So let's see what we got here. We got the New Age Performers. There you go. We got the uh, 20 Years of the Giants, Willie Mays. Awesome. We got flashbacks for the first microprocessor. Again, I wish these were more, uh, you know, finding more packs. I got a miniature 
Guerrero Jr. card? I got it. Oh, you got Fine. And then we got a serially numbered 99 out of 99 gold. Oh, I wonder if that's... Yeah, that must be considered the gold. Did I say gold when I did this? Let me look at these stats oh, again. Oh, Lord. I know. Relic gold, yes. So normal relics... Normal relics is 1 in 71 packs. The relic gold is 1 in 897 packs. So that, that what you got? yes, and that that's why it's gold. That's why it's uh, numbered like that out of ninety nine. So very very cool. So it's gold. Usually they're you know not gold and not numbered. So there you go. All right, thank you very much for Tops Heritage. I don't know what's coming up next. I got to check the release schedule, but uh, again, please check out uh, Nerd Stop. Nerd Stop. Uh, discussions with without, without repercussions. Discussions without repercussions available on all major podcasting uh, streams. Uh, firstcomicsnews.com also hosts it, and you can see my podcast, First Comics News Podcast, where I talk about comics, movies, and television shows. Um, I think that's it for us for now. I got some more work to do at the, around the house, so we'll see you again real soon. Uh, before we go, so I want to let you know MLB 2020 is coming out. Uh, mm -hmm. Super Mega Baseball. Super Mega Baseball 3 mm -hmm. is coming out, and also next week is RBI Baseball. Uh, 20. So we're going to try to do some downstairs. I'm going to hook up the, the cameras again. We're going to do some live streams, uh, broadcasts, uh, let's play uh, of the baseball games if you're up for it. Yeah. All right, cool. So Kick your butt. Uh, we'll see about that. I'll be playing the Indians, so you probably will. But you won't have Mookie Betts, so advantage Lindor. See you guys again next time. Thanks for watching. Bye.